greetings of the day today we will learn about different types of motion different objects show different types of motions these different types of motion can be divided into the following categories translatory motion rotational motion circular motion periodic motion non periodic motion oscillatory motion or vibrational motion and random motion now let us study each type of motion in detail first translatory motion when an object moves as a whole that is if all its parts move the same distance in a given time it is said to be in translatory motion a train moving on the track throwing of a ball opening of a door etc are some examples of translatory motion translatory motion is of two types rectilinear and curvilinear motion when a body moves along a straight line it is said to be in a linear or rectilinear motion an athlete running on a straight path a freely falling apple or a car moving on a straight road are some examples of rectilinear motion when a body moves along a curved path it is said to be in curvilinear motion a car moving along a curved path and a ball thrown up in the air are some examples of curvilinear motion next rotational motion when a body moves about a fixed central point or axis without changing its position is said to be in rotational motion rotation of the earth about its axis the motion of the blades of a fan and a spinning top are some examples of rotational motion next circular motion when a body moves around a circular path in such a way that its position keeps changing with time is said to be in a circular motion remember that in circular motion the distance of body from the center of circular path remains the same and the body reaches the same point from where it started its motion the motion of the earth around the sun the motion of a toy train around a circular path are some examples of circular motion let us understand oscillatory motion the to and fro movement of a body about a fixed position often referred to as mean position is called an oscillatory motion the movement of a pendulum and swing etc are examples of oscillatory motion when oscillation takes place at a rapid rate it is called vibratory motion movement of our vocal cords and ringing alarm clock are some examples of vibratory motion a vibrating body produces sound next is periodic motion motion which repeats itself after a fixed or regular intervals of time is called periodic motion beating of the heart motion of the planets around the sun and around its axis motion of a pendulum are some examples of periodic motion next is non periodic motion when an object does not repeat its motion after a fixed interval of time it is said to be in non periodic motion swaying of the branches of the tree motion of a moving car birds flying in the air are examples of non periodic motion next random motion when the motion of the object does not follow a fixed path and keeps on changing its direction the motion is said to be random motion the motion of a flying bee motion of an ant motion of a football player 
on the ground are some examples of random motion sometimes an object can show different kinds of motion at the same time for example the earth rotates about its axis while revolving around the sun thus the motion of the earth is a combination of rotational circular and periodic motion a ball rolling on the floor shows rotational motion as well as translatory motion motion of hands of clock or watches also shows periodic as well as circular motion